Ready, set, go. Let's get into this message. Hope you're having a blessed day. Hope you woke up feeling rejuvenated and refreshed. Let's get into the message. Anxiety weighs down the heart, but a kind word cheers it up. Proverbs 12, 25. I always like to start off the day with a message because this is the daily devotional that's going to rejuvenate you and refresh you. And it says always to renew your mind each and every morning before you even start your day, because it gets so easy for us to jump out of bed, be like, oh, we're late. But just relax and know that everything is going to work itself out. It is so easy for us to fill our mind with anxiety and fear and just focus on the future. And half of the time, these things that we so focus on never even comes to pass. It's all made up in our mind. And if we stay so tuned into the world, that's what it's gonna continuously do to our brain. We're gonna just be lost and understand why are we spiraling out of control? But we have to turn to the source, our creator, our provider, the one above. He take care of all our fear. He say we can turn to him and get rest. Plus he give us the Sabbath to be able to relax and rest. Everyone is going constantly each and every moment of the day. When do you get time to rejuvenate and refresh your mind, spend time with the Lord? That is the only way that's going to get you to the next level in your life. The more we try to do it in our own strength, the more we try to handle everything and take on all the battles ourselves without reaching out to our creator. Where do you really think that's going to get us in life? Where do you think so? The way we are created, the only way we get charged up, the only way we get refreshed, renewed is by a good word from the Lord. Staying in your Bible is not just because, oh, it's so boring or it's to be on the goody two shoe list or to be living this righteous life. It does something to your mind, body, spirit. It gives you new wings to fly again. You know how many times I'm going down the road of, oh, I don't know if this is going to work out. Or oh, I'm working so hard. I'm trying to do everything in my own strength. And then I'm getting all frustrated and the people I get around is like, I don't even hear what they're saying because I'm so focused on the future and, the, and making things happen in my own strength. But then when I turn to the word and I'm renewed and refreshed each and every morning, I get messages, some scriptures just like this to be like, yeah, you're right. I was tripping. Yes, Father, let me turn back to you because it's only through you you're going to give me the strength. You're going to give me a good word like this. So therefore, I can come out and help your sheep, help your lost people, and help to wake them up as well if they're not getting into their daily devotionals, if they're not reading their Bibles. I guess that's where I come in to remind you to turn back to the source. And it's only through the source, our provider, our Lord, creator, that we're going to be healed, that we're going to be refreshed, that we're going to be rejuvenated to take on whatever the day may throw at us because the day will throw something at you. But until next time, take care of yourself.